Researchers have made a game-changing breakthrough in diagnosing a common genetic heart condition that causes healthy young people to die suddenly, sometimes without ever showing any symptoms. A new study has explored what doctors once called junk DNA, discovering it holds the key to the devastating addition. Here's Ursula Hager. Michaela Marie lost her little brother to a heart attack 12 years ago. The healthy 21-year-old was just talking with friends and the next moment he was gone. It was so sudden. There was no chance for us to even know that there was anything wrong with Josh. Like, we didn't know he was sick. Josh had suffered hyperthropic cardiomyopathy that causes the heart walls to thicken. And while a genetic link was known, it was often difficult to diagnose until now. This area of genetic information was once called junk DNA. We thought the DNA had no role in human disease, but now we've identified genetic abnormalities in this so-called junk DNA, which lead to life-threatening heart conditions. Using a state government grant, medical researchers at the Centenary Institute searched entire genomes, 3.2 billion individual letters on each patient to find the link. So we call this type of research bench to bedside because the results that I find today at the bench will help the families tomorrow. You may have never heard of hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, but it is a relatively common condition. One in every 200 Australians suffers from it, and about half don't even know they have it. For Michaela, it means with the help of IVF, she can now make sure it's not passed on to her children. I burst into tears when I, when I found this news out, and for the first time in this journey, I had hope. Hope her family's legacy can help put a genetic killer to rest. Ursula Hager, 10 Eyewitness News.